Don't miss a beat, join the notification squad by clicking that bell, you'll get notified every time I upload a video, and be sure to join our Discord to talk and get help with your code. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Source Code, my name is Alonso, and here we are in a new Minecraft video. Uh, in today's video, we're going to be learning how to create a Lucky Black plugin. Uh, this will be the part one of this tutorial, because in this video, I will explain how the Lucky Black plugin will be working. In the next part, will be uh, I'll be explaining, or I'll be creating new surprises for your Lucky Black plugin. As I said in this plugin, you will be learning how it should be working and we will be creating some surprises so you can see it works. So to start, we need to implement listener here because we're going to be listening to the block break event. Let's use event handle here, public, public void on break and let's listen to block break event. E. As you already know, uh, Lucky Black plugin usually use a sponge as Lucky Blocks. So we're going to check if the broken block is not an sponge. We are going to return. Either get block, get type is not equal to material sponge. We return because we don't care. Let's get the location of the block, of the broken block. Location, either get block, get location. And let's add 0.5 because we want to have the middle of the block. If we don't add those numbers, uh, the location will be in the corner of the block. So uh, let's also cancel the event and let's set the block type to air. Material air because uh, we're gonna we need to cancel the event and set the material so it looks like it the block disappeared and it's not dropped. So um let's register the event here before we forget it. Plugin, get server, get plugin manager, register event, this and plugin. For a lucky block plugin, we're gonna be using random numbers. I'm gonna create a random number right now. Random number. It's equal to new random new random next int and here we need to select uh, the number of surprises we're going to have for example if in this case I'm gonna have three surprises so I'm gonna uh, select three use three because it will create a random number between zero and two it means the number could be zero one or two okay so now we can switch and use the random number we created. In the case that the random number is zero, we're going to run this one here. In the case is one, we're going to run this here. And in the case it's two, we're going to run the code here. Okay, so the first one, I'm gonna be creating uh, the most common one that will be a witch and some bats flying around. So let's say location, get word, spawn location, and let's select bat class. Bat uh, 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 and class. I need to import the class here. <laughs> okay, so let's copy this one here. So we have five bats here flying around. And let's also create a witch. Witch. So we have one witch and we have one bot. So we can now set the passenger. Keep in mind that I'm using 1.8, so I need to use some deprecated code, otherwise the plane don't work. Um, which it means that the witch will be the passenger of the bat of one of the five bats I created. Okay, so this next surprise will be um, a wolf. Okay, so I'm gonna use 
Um, mm, mm, location, get work, spawn, location. And let's use wolf glass. And let's also drop some. Uh, let's drop some. Uh, 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 some bones. Okay, so we can uh, use them. New item stack, material, bone, and let's drop seven bones. Let's also send uh, a sound to the player that broke the block, the lucky block. Sound value of. I'm gonna use value of because I'm right now using 1.10. 1.10 uh, jar and I cannot find the correct value the sound for 1.8 so I'm gonna use wolf and world nope world here okay so now I need to choose two float here let's use five and one here and the last one will be just an explosion uh, location get word create explosion and the location will be this and the power of the explosion will be 2 and it will destroy blocks and create fire okay so now the plane should be working don't forget to init light the glass here see here this and there's something I forgot here mm -mm. Uh, uh, uh. Oh yeah, forgot a column here. So um, so let's start the play in. Uh, uh, uh. It says it's deprecated, but it's okay because I'm using it because I'm using 1.8.8. Okay, let's start the server. It start correctly. Let's open. Let's join the server, and let's test it. If we, for example, place some blocks here, and we break them, we get the witch. In this case, we are going to get another witch. One more. We get explosion here. Another explosion here. A wolf there, so we can use the bones here so it's now my wolf we can break another block here it's another explosion and so on we can create as many surprises as we want in the next video i'm gonna be showing you how to create more surprises give me ideas in the comment section so i can use them to create some surprises for you and that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you really guys enjoyed the video. If you like, please hit the like button and subscribe for new videos. And that's all for today. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.